Mississippi chapters held a blood drive at Edgewater Mall through a partnership with the Red Cross. Jacoby Rivers spoke with members of the fraternity and sorority who both say this drive is to help honor a legacy. Two organizations come together for one mission, provide help for those in need. The IOTA Epsilon Fraternity, with help from Delta Sigma Theta Gulf Coast Alumni Chapter, held a blood drive Saturday to honor Charles Richard Drew, who is nicknamed the father of the blood bank. Before his uh, initiatives and innovation and all the things he did during World War II, blood uh, wasn't being properly stored and uh, distributed. And he came along and showed uh, people how you can actually store it and henceforth a lot of lives are saved. Both organizations say a blood drive like this is personal to them because of Drew being in the fraternity and how a lack of donations can affect someone's health. Um, my brother is now in stage four colon cancer and he just had to have a blood transfusion. So that really hit home for me as far as saying, wow, like how many people are actually giving? What are the stipulations to give? So um, we just encourage people to think about um, what this means to give back and in the, in the most important way of giving life back. I think he would be so proud, and I'm proud and blessed to be in a country that we can um, give blood, mm -hmm. and it's uh, tested properly, and it's safe, and um, like I said, the community is so, uh, they're just so taken care of because of what we're doing here today. This is not just about the sorority and the fraternity, it's about the community as well, donating and giving back. A blood drive aimed to helping people, as well as honoring a legacy. Jacoby Rivers, WLOX News Now. Goldsmith says he would like to thank the sororities who helped out with the blood drive today, and they will continue to keep it an annual drive every February.